Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 4.10 p.m., and it's Friday, July 31st, 2020. Today's the last day of July. Yesterday, I went to Oakmonkey, and I got a haircut, see what I mean? Oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing an energy drink that I've been wanting to try. It's been out for about a month, but I'm, I've been looking for it, and I haven't been able to find it. Basically, you know, with all their distributing problems, you know, with, you know, the pandemic and stuff. And also the can shortage that's been happening recently. So, you know, I've been having a hard time finding drinks, you know, lately. Um, but anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing a new Bang Energy drink. Oh, yeah, it's very rad, that's for sure. Very punk, very rebel, I guess. Um, very neon, you know. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the brand new Radical Skedaddle Bang Energy drink. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. 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 Anyway, it has a silver top with a silver tab. Bombs of Best Bite Date and Production Code. July 20. Well, July 31st, 2021. So it's fresh till exactly one year from today. So, you know, that's interesting. Okay, and anyway, the colors of the can is basically the same as the, um, the Rainbow Unicorn one, except it's like a darker shade of the can, you know? Because the Rainbow Unicorn is like a pink and blue, this is like a purplish pink and blue, so it's a little bit of a darker color than the Rainbow Unicorn, um, Rainbow Unicorn, you know? Sorry for something, but you know, it's like a darker shade, so it's a little bit hard to see, so you might have to look carefully, because you might think it's like a Rainbow Unicorn, you know? But yeah... Anyway, around the top it says Super Creatine, Ultra COQ10, EA Aminos, Bang Potent Brand Body Fuel, Radical Skedaddle, Natural Flavor, 16 foot ounces, 1 pint, 473 milliliters, 0 calories per can. Bang Potent Brand Body Fuel by the makers of the legendary Redline Energy products. Make no mistake, Bang is not your stereotypical high sugar life sucking soda, masquerading as an energy drink. High sugar drinks spike blood sugar, producing metabolic mayhem, causing you to crash harder than a test dummy into a brick wall. Powered with Bang's potent brain and body rocking fuel, super creatine, caffeine, COQ10, and EAAs, essential amino acids. Life's an extreme sport, and Bang is the extreme energy source to live life extreme. Not intended for individuals under age of 18. Main USA domestic import ingredients, US patent number 84454 um, or 65, I don't know for sure, but anyway. Um, zero carbs, zero sugars, zero calories, zero artificial colors. Caution not use the product for your pregnant or nursing, not consume this product if you're taking any prescription drug and or having a medical condition. This product contains caffeine and should not be used with any other caffeine containing products. This product is intended for use by healthy individuals only. It's, the consumer assumes all liability if this product is used in a manner not consistent with label guidelines. So, you know, it'll get you late, you know, it has 300 milligrams caffeine. So, you know, don't OD, drink in moderation, you know, just saying. Probably shouldn't drink if you have anxiety problems and stuff too, you know. Um, but anyway, please recycle, distributed by Vital Pharmaceuticals Incorporated, 1600 North Park Drive, Weston, Florida, 33326 USA. To report a serious adverse event or obtain product information, contact 954-641-0570, um, extension number 3508. Info at vpxsports.com, copyright 2020, Vital Pharmaceuticals Incorporated, all rights reserved. Instagram at Bang Energy, bang-energy.com. Best by Data Bottom has SKU, the Crown logo, and some other codes. Um, stable Aquaeus Amide Protected Bioactive Creatine Species, U.S. Patent Number 84445466. Nutrition Facts Serum Size 1 Can, 16 Fluid Ounces, 473 Milliliters. Amount per serving calories, 0 total fat, 0 grams, 0 percent. Saturated fat, 0 grams, 0 percent. Trans fat, 0 grams. Cholesterol, 0 milligrams, 0 percent. Sodium, 40 milligrams, 2 percent. Total carbohydrate, 0 grams, 0 percent. Dietary fiber, 0 grams, 0 percent. Total sugar, 0 grams, includes 0 grams added sugar, 0% protein, 0 grams. Vitamin D, 0 micrograms, 0%. Calcium, 5 milligrams, 0%. Iron, 0 milligrams, 0%. Potassium, 85 milligrams, 2%. Vitamin C, 27 milligrams, 30%. Niacin, 5 milligrams, 30%. Vitamin B6, 0 0.5 milligrams, 30%. Vitamin B12, 1.5 micrograms, 60%. Magnesium, 5 milligrams, 1%. Okay, it has other ingredients, it has EAAs, it's L-leucine, L-isoleucine, L-valine, L-lysine, or tysine, L-thurionine, L-phenylanine, and 
L Estidine, L Methylonine, and L Trifodophan. Has a super creatine. Warning too much caffeine may cause nervousness, irritability, sleeplessness, and occasional rapid heartbeat. Not recommended for use by individuals under 18 years of age. One serving of bang provides 300 milligrams of caffeine, which is more than two cups of coffee. Phenolate content in yours contains phenylalanine, so yeah. So that's pretty much the whole can. So I'll let you see it right quick. We showed you the top and bottom, but anyway, well. And yeah, I got this at a quick trip. It was two for four dollars, so you know, it's okay price, I guess. But yeah, um, some Walmarts have these, but um, well, they don't have these yet, but they have like a sticker on their refrigerator, so they should be getting them, you know, at Walmart soon. Hopefully, you know, with, you know, all their distributing, like, um, all the, you know, can shortage problems and stuff. Hopefully, you know, it doesn't, like, mess it up or anything. Hopefully, you'll be able to find it soon, you know, just saying, if you haven't found it already, you know. Yeah, it took me about a month to find it, so, you know. And um, I got the crisp apple one, like right when it like came out. But this one, I had a hard time finding, you know. Okay, hopefully you can see that text. Okay, it's a little. Um, a bit hard to see the can color and the text font color, you know. It's a little bit reflective. Okay, there's the other codes. Uh, can't really see it too good. It's printed a little messed up too, so you know. But anyway, here's the nutrition facts, and I got like the best condition cans they've had, but um, it's so like scraped up and stuff, the paint is anyway. I bought another can because, you know, it was two for four dollars, but um, it was like in good condition, but it got dented, you know, when I had the Saka in my car, you know. Yeah, this text is like printed messed up and a little bit hard to see. So, probably doesn't have to pause it, you know, wherever. Okay, the warning. Okay, that's pretty much the whole can. But anyway, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna shake it up, open it, taste it, and get my review for it. So, hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it, and the color is clear like all the other bangs, except, you know, the tea ones, you know, and the coffee ones. Yeah, it's clear, it's bubbling. Anyway, the scent. Ooh. Ooh. It smells like, um, something I had before. <sighs> well... It smells a little bit like the um, Carnival Candy Grape Lani New that I reviewed recently. It has a little bit of like a bubblegum scent. Like a cotton candy or a bubblegum type of scent, you know? Um, it does smell a little bit like the cotton candy bang. And also it has a smell that's a little bit similar to like an original Rockstar type of smell. Like that, you know, original, like, citrusy, you know, grana type of scent. It smells a little bit like that. Like a rock star clone type of smell. But, um, also a little bit like bubble gum or cotton candy, so you know what I mean. But yeah, it smells definitely very fruity. Um, very mixed fruit type of smell. Um, also a little bit like the, um... 
the lemon heads rain, and um, I guess also the sour heads bang a teeny bit. But yeah, it definitely smells fruity, but anyway, now I'm gonna try it, so here goes. Ooh. Well, taste how it smells. Basically like a mixture of flavors. Sweet though. A little tart and tangy. Well, um, I think the base is like a Rockstar clone type of flavor. Um, tastes similar to the um, Kickin' Classic Stacker 2, you know? And also the Playboy Energy Drink that I reviewed before. Well, the sugar-free Playboy, but you know what I mean? I never reviewed the original one. Because I couldn't find it. They only had the sugar-free one up, my Big Lots. But, um, yeah, it has a like, same Rockstar clone type of taste. But when you first try it, it does taste similar to the Carnival Candy Grape Alani New a little bit. Definitely like a grape flavor when you first sip it. Yeah, like grape. And um, then it tastes a little bit like cotton candy and bubble gum, you know? Mm -hmm. Definitely a mixture of flavors. Ooh. I like it though, it's actually pretty good. But maybe if it didn't have that, you know, base, like original type of energy drink flavor, you know, it'd probably be pretty good. They made it just like a grape flavor in a blue and pink can, you know, that would have been pretty cool. Because, you know, it doesn't look like it would be a grape flavor, but, you know, it does taste like grape a little bit. You know, especially in the beginning. Even though I think the purple haze one was supposed to be grape, but, um, this one tastes like more like a grape flavor, you know, than that one did to me anyway. But, yeah, I like it. It's pretty good. I don't know if it's my favorite one of these bangs. I don't know. I think I like the, um, hmm, I don't know if I like the Blue Raz one best still, or the, um, Rainbow Unicorn. And the Candy Apple Crisp one. I really like that one, too. But yeah, it's still pretty good. Not as good as the Blue Raz, the, um, Rainbow Unicorn, or the Birthday Cake one, or the Candy Apple one. You know, it's still pretty good, though. Yeah, it has a cool can design. It's okay price. It's two for $4 at Quick Trip. Energy-wise, it lasts about five and a half hours. It's about six and a half hours of energy. So, you know, it works really good. It will get you lit, you know, drinking moderation. Don't OD, you know, drinking um, safe amounts, I guess, too. And um, don't drink if you have anxiety problems or, like, other health issues, you know, like um, heart issues and stuff. Because, you know, it will get you lit, boys. It will get you lit. It will get you lit, you know, just saying. It has 300 milligrams of caffeine. Really strong energy wise, you know. Yeah, the flavors, um, a pretty good, unique mixture of flavors. Um, taste is sweet and it's good. But, um, it's still, like, not one of my favorite bangs, though, even though it's still pretty good. But, you know, yeah, definitely try it, though, if you can find it. It's still pretty good. So, I'm gonna give the new Radical Skedaddle Bang Energy Drink a 9 out of 10. Oh, yeah, boys, it's lit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely try it if you can find it. It's brand new, really good. Definitely check it out. But yeah, I give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, it's definitely lit. Very rad. Because you know it's radical skedaddle. So you know, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. But yeah, oh yeah. Definitely try it though. I give it a 9 out of 10. Anyway, my next review will probably be the new watermelon Alani new energy drink. I have to get it um in a few days, you know, after I get paid and I go to Tulsa again and go to the quick trip. I'll get the other new design of Lonnie News. I'll show them off, you know, in that video, too, you know. And then I don't know what I'm going to be reviewing after that. Um, the new Juice Monsters are supposed to be coming out soon. So I already got a sample can on Reddit, you know. But yeah, see you for more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.